Hello, beloved. I'm here in the Philippines, and I have a special message for you. As you can see, the water behind me and the palm trees, and this is my normal environment. But there's something wrong with this picture because it's Christmas, for goodness sake, and I can't seem to comprehend and imagine that it's Christmas because there's no snow. So let's pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, you know you say we can speak those things that are not as they are. I'm asking in the name of Jesus for snow, water, and the lights, and the rain, sing the snow. partners, all of our intercessors, those who are special donors, those who lifted up our hands in a very special way this 2019 and say a blessed Christmas to you. May this Christmas be the best one you've ever had, full of happiness and the joy of the Lord. And beloved, may you remember that in this season, you can get an eternal gift, not a temporal gift with toys or something that's will pass away, but something that can change the hearts of your love forever. And it's the good news of Jesus Christ. You can give them the message that there's someone who came, someone who died on the cross, someone who's pure, spotless, who's the savior of all mankind, and who can come into their hearts and change their lives just by praying the prayer of salvation. You know, in this hour, where there's so many in the valley of decision, so many oppressed, depressed, don't know where they're coming or going, don't, are all looking for love in all the wrong places. This is the year to give people the joy of the world, Jesus Christ. He's the reason for the season. And we want to declare this year, hallelujah, that he's no longer in a manger, hallelujah. He's no longer a little baby, but he's coming back again as King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. The coming of the Lord is imminent. And beloved in this season, I pray that God makes you such a light that shines in darkness wherever you go this Christmas season that you're able to share the love of Christ to each and every hurting soul. We want to thank you. We want to bless you this Christmas season. We love you for the fullest ministry and fullness of God needed to be. God bless you.